So I was going to do a nifty fancy little, um, you know, sort of my normal review video, if you will, of the Kinsey 1300 Harvest Commander. I don't know if they call these Harvest Commander or not. Anyway, the Kinsey Grain Cart from SpecCast, but I recorded it on my um, GoPro camera. And as it turns out, the sound didn't work for some reason. So we're going to have to do it on the cell phone. And it's probably going to be shaky. It's probably not going to be nearly as good. No music or anything like that. But let's talk tractors, y'all, or implements. <laughs> All right. So Kinsey 1300. So we obviously have the soft track version here. And the really cool thing about this is it actually, oops, it actually rolls really, really, really easy, which is cool. And... Um, it's got lots of lots of detail. So we've got lights here and they're actual sort of like amber inserts, not just decals. Same thing here. They've even got a little texture to them. You got your little clean out uh, chute back there for the auger or whatever. And uh, you know, the side's much of the same. So obviously we've got a window looking in and our SMB sign down below. Then we'll pop up here and take a look inside. And Boy, is there a lot of detail in there. You've got your cross members, you've got your your cage, obviously, and you know, you've even got your sort of auger supports and all of that, your auger shield supports, I should say. Kind of moving around here a little bit. So more of the same up here. Just really, really incredible detail. I even like these supports. And these are metal. That's not plastic. Same thing with the side, so um, <clears throat> you can kind of hear it ringing there. So. Um, there were some complaints about the price of these when they came out, because I think these were in the neighborhood of $250 or $300 when they were brand new. So that's obviously pricey, but again, we've got some actual die cast or metal here. Now, now obviously some of the detail, like this, is plastic, but these aren't. And um, this is the chute, the auger, if you will. And you've got the adjustment here. Now, it doesn't actually, uh, this doesn't actually pivot, which is that's fine, no big deal. Looking in there, and you've got tons of detail there with your auger and flighting and all that. <clears throat> We've got your uh, your gate gauge here, or whatever you call that. Cylinder detail here, so that's cool. Cylinder detail here, and obviously, let's let's show you. Oops, oops sorry. Terrible camera work, so you can see that actually moves. Hydraulic lines run down into the frame. and up to the uh, hydraulics of the tractor. Now I don't have them hooked into this 620 uh, Steiger, obviously, but. Now you get your regular sort of Ertl style hitch. I don't know why, I'm, it's a spec cast, but that's an Ertl style hitch. So that'll hook into almost any tractor you've got, except for <laughs> your high detail Steiger 620s. PTO, and then you've got your, your jack stand, and I'll show you, that does go up and down. So we've even got some detail up under here and everything. So, okay, so this is just going to be a quick maybe two or three minute video here. Nothing too fancy and exciting, but I wanted to show you the Kinsey 1300 soft track grain cart from SpecCast. And now here's the deal with these. So I got one of these. I wanted one when they came out, but like I said, 250, 300 bucks wasn't going to happen. So these are on sale right now at several different vendors for a buck thirty-five, one hundred thirty-five bucks plus shipping, of course. It's a pretty sweet deal at that price. I, I you know, I'm not going to sugarcoat it. If uh, if you need a big grain cart for your one sixteen scale collection, this is the one because, well, your only other options are the older Kinsey Harvest Commanders, which are awesome, by the way. But um, they're getting a little harder to find, but this guy's still out there. You can get it in singles, tracks, or duels. Anyway, that's all for today, folks. Hope you guys have yourselves a great Memorial Day weekend. Please be safe out there. Happy toy hunting. Thanks for watching.